me, can I help you? Yeah, I want to see Officer Mack. Is there a problem with that? Is he expecting you? Look, if he's in there and I'm out here, what difference I'm does just, it make? I'm asking if you have an appointment. No, okay? I don't have an appointment, okay? He never makes no appointments when he comes to my place. He just... Anyway, this is very important. Well, um, ordinarily you have so to you have... So, you see, I, I tried to call you. I really, I did. But your line was very busy. Well, I'm sorry, but uh, you're just going to have to have oh, a seat Don't you tell me what I have... I'm sorry, I'm sorry, okay? It's just, I came a long way to see him. A really, a long way. And, and I'm sorry, okay? Okay. Gene, it's uh, me again. Listen, um, you have a uh, client here to see you, and he doesn't have an appointment, but uh, he seems uh, he seems upset, and I was just... No, I didn't ask him that, but just a minute, and I'll... No, that's all right. Uh, I'll handle it, whoever it is. Listen, you know, some of them uh, fail to show up when they do have appointments, and others show up when they don't. <laughs> Send him on in. This is as good a time as any. All right, he'll see you. Um, his office is right All down there. All the way down, down the hallway on the right. You say that every time, don't you remember? Every damn time. Ah, Mr. Wilkes, I wondered who it was. You don't need to close the door, Mr. Wilkes, now. Uh, what's on your mind? I'm gonna kill you, motherfucker. How about we start with that? What would you do? It's Pete Turner. Joe? Yeah. Hi, Joe. Stop by to see how you're doing. Doing fine. So can I come in? Don't see nobody stopping you. Dog Joe? We're keeping it for uh, Lenny's brother while he's on the road. You uh, like dogs? I like them if they like me. Well, we got them in the bedroom. You want me to go get them? We'll find out. No, thanks. Is that door closed? Yeah, it's closed. Well, how are things going? Fine. Back. It's been bothering me a little bit lately. This furniture really sets it off. So how's the job? How's the job, he asks. Oh, it's cool, man. Couldn't be better. Yeah? Got my review. Old man Farrell says, well, Mr. Mobley, you've been doing such a good job around here, we're just going to have to make you employee of the month. You're kidding, right? Would I kid you, my good buddy, that comes to visit me at work? You want to tell me what really happened? I got yelled at, man. That's what happened. I got two weeks to straighten my ass out. Did he tell you what's the problem? What he told me and what it is is two different things. Because it's easy to find stuff a guy does wrong if you watch him every goddamn minute. And that's what he does. Because he's had it in for me ever since he heard I served time. No, Maybe so you remember it. how he found that out? And it's not bad enough you have to call him. Then you come in for a goddamn tour. Job's bad enough. Now, when you stopping in. And sniffing around don't help. Well, now, let's think about this. Maybe it would help if... No, I... don't do anything else. I've had just about all the help I can take from you. What would you do?
Hi. Hi, Joe. This is Christine Manella. She's another officer. Hi, Joe. Oh, well, hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Come on in. You, uh, want to sit down? Thanks. I like the new coffee table, Joe. Thanks. Uh, you want to sit down? Oh, no thanks. I'm fine. I've been sitting in the car all day. I'm better off standing up. You people think something's wrong with my couch? You see cooties? I don't see cooties. Your couch is fine. So how's the job, Joe? Better. Thanks, that helped. Uh, what you did. Glad to hear it. Anything else new? Ain't been having a lot of adventures lately, except for Lenny. She's always an adventure. You bet I am. Hi. Hi, Vinny. Pete, remember? And this is Christine Manella. Hi. It's all we need is two of them. Can I sit down? Sure. Place is looking good. Nice canvas. What's that? Joe? How do I know? What does it look like? It looked like Coke, didn't it? Look, I told you I don't know. If it's Coke, it's not my Coke. Oh, so if it's not yours, then I guess it must be mine then. Thanks a lot. Well? Well? Well, all I got to say is none of your business. Look, you might be his boss, but you are not mine. What I have in my house is my own business. You know the rules, Lenny. As long as Joe lives here, it's my job to know what's in the house. You do not want to mess with me. We're here to help Joe stay out of prison. Having Coke in the house violates his supervision. That's a problem. We need to work it out. If you want to sit down, we can talk about it calmly. No, I do not want to sit down and be calm. You tell him what to do every minute, now you're after me. Sit down, be calm, do this, do that. I have had enough of your shit. Okay, we'll go. Christine? Oh, and do what? Call the cops? Be sure to tell him you light the candle. We'll talk about it later. Not with me, you won't. I got nothing to say to you now or ever. I am not your fucking case. If you want to run my life, I want to see you try. What would you do?